No. Rick! Get your father! Get Jersey and get my father! My father's a cop! People believe that their connections will shield them from criminal charges, but police use their power to ensure that everyone faces justice equally. From the woman who tried to exploit her connections to evade arrest. Is this all the same guy? No, these, these yeah, these, that's my grandpa. He's a, a retired police officer in Gloucester Township in New Jersey. Okay. South Jersey. Yeah. To the cop's sister, who chose to disregard the law. Uh, be honest with me, how much did you really have to drink tonight? We, I had two glasses of wine at Charlie's, okay. and then I came to Gabriella's, mm -hmm. and then they gave everybody like a champagne. I had a sip. Here are some instances when cops have had to arrest unruly individuals. Starting with this woman, whose temper tantrum was a fireworks display gone awry. The cops stepped in to extinguish the final explosion. Not gonna happen. Not gonna happen. Knock it off now. Do you hear me? On April 5th, 2024, police conducted a traffic stop on a vehicle in Monroe County for failing to maintain its lane. When the cops interact with the woman, they gather details about her. As soon as they notice her unusual condition, she tries to cover it up with excuses. It's been a lot of things. Okay, okay man. Ma'am, this is a, a registration out of Tennessee. You have a Florida plate. Yeah, I know. Because I just heard four units. So can I get that paper in your hand right there? Can I see that paper? You can take that one back. She's telling him to open the door. We're still in like... Ma'am, do you have the other side of this? It's supposed to be like one big paper. So it's probably that that's ripped up right there. So, no, not that one. I see Tennessee one. So right there. That one. Right there. Yes, ma'am. So, where are you coming from tonight? So you're coming from Key West? Yes. Key West? What were you doing down there in Key West? Just exploring. Exploring? Exploring. Where are you going? Home. Where's home at? Sarasota. Sarasota? You drive all the way up there right now? 4103 Or you don't have like no hotel or nothing like that? What? You don't have no hotel or nothing like that? You speak English and you're supposed to be a cop? I can, I'm speaking perfect English. No, you're not. Uh, yes, I am. Yes, I am. No. Yes, I am. I'm speaking perfect English. Can I see your license there? So you live in the state of Florida now? Well, I do now. You do now? How long have you been down here in Florida? 30 days. 30 days? Well, make sure you change this to Florida if you live here now. All right. Any drinking tonight, ma'am? You sure about that? So no drinking down in Key West? All right, I'll be right back with you. Alrighty, ma'am. You wanna do me a favor and help out the vehicle for me, please? It's up over here. 
So down in Key West, you had nothing to drink? No. Not one drink? No. Are you sure about that? Yes. All right, so I feel that you're impaired by alcohol or drugs. Would you like to perform field sobriety exercises to dispel my belief for that? I don't think that I have should go under whatever you're saying right now because you pulled me over. Yes, ma'am, I did. I did pull you over. The police notify the suspect of the required test to evaluate her condition. However, she ignores their directives and faces the ensuing consequences. And I'm asking, I, I think that you're impaired, so we like to perform and field sobriety exercises to dispel my belief of that. Yes or no question? No. No? All right, so I'm, I'm gonna read you this, if I can find it. Trying to get the exact words for you. All right, it's not here. All right, by saying no, by saying no, that can be used against you in a criminal uh, criminal proceeding. Do you understand that? So by saying no, it be used against you in a criminal proceeding. So, with that in mind. Are you still saying no to the field sobriety exercises? I feel like I'm talking to like a retard right now. First off, <sighs> you pull me over for what? Failure to maintain lane. He crossed the right lane, right lane four times and he crossed the other one three times. Okay, and then? That's it. So, would you like to perform in field sobriety exercises? No? Alright, well, how many of you place your hands behind your back? You can place on your rest for DUI. Can you it? Come on, man. Where's your shoes at? In your car? You heard? Are your shoes in your car? Hold on, ma'am. I'm not talking to you. All right. Well, no, I'm just, I'm just taking, making sure there's nothing in there. All right, you can step in now. Turkey, hold that for me. You alright, ma'am? No, I don't like you. Right, sorry You're not that. a good person. Sorry about that. Alright. Ma'am, you gotta sit right here. I need to put your seat button on, come on. No. Alright. At that moment, the suspect executed a surprising maneuver that surprised the cops. They swiftly took the necessary steps to restore order. Ma'am, get back in the car. No, I don't like you. What I are you don't doing? like you. Get back in the car. Come on, let me just say one thing. Ma'am, you want to get pepper sprayed or no? You want to get pepper sprayed? Do you want to get pepper sprayed? Come on. You're gonna sit right here. Right. I'm gonna sit right here. Yankee 31, yeah, x ray, x ray. Y31, yes, x ray. Are you gonna hop in the car? Why? Are you gonna hop in the car? Man, we're sitting right here. <laughs> Are you gonna hop in the car? No. Will you go on the highway? 
Nope. Nope, you're coming with me, come on. Nope. On three, we're gonna stand up and we're gonna go to the car. Yes. Yes. Ready? Get off. Come on. Get in the car, man. No. Stop. Oh, you're coming with us, so get in the car. I got a charge. Damage to the room. Let me out. Let me out. Sir. Yeah, I got you. Uh, send me a number. I'll give you a call. You're not a very nice person. I just hope you understand this. Alright, sorry. You're fake, and I don't like you. Take me the f home. Right now. <laughs> You're not going on now, man. You actually caught another charge. For what? Resisting. Resisting what? Resisting been... me and my partner over there. I didn't resist anything. Did. No, I did not. Yes, you did. I've been sitting in the f***ing back of this f***ing It's the thrill of your life back here. Go away. You better get my f***ing purse. I did, and your phone. See how nice we got him? No, you're not. You can nice to tell where's your key. I'm not telling you because you are a snitch. Alright. You got the car? Yep. Alright, uh, you. you didn't call for Who's driving my f***ing car? You ain't told. Towing company. Well, I'm, I'm sorry. You didn't call, you didn't call for uh... No, I think you're a f***ing oh. You wanted to pull somebody oh, over. You have nothing better to do with your life. Nope, man, this is my job. I'm just doing my job. Yeah, okay. You have nothing better to f do right, with man. your life. Yeah, you can talk to the record. Who's driving my f car? Game code. Why? Because I said it is. In the police cruiser, the suspect attempted to be dramatic in a bid to escape the situation, but the effort proved futile. You're so dramatic. Oh my god, you're worse than my ex boyfriend. Who is driving my Car. I don't like you. I think you should run home. Stop talking! Shut up! No one likes you. Stop talking. No one likes you. I'm gonna kick you in the face. You understand that, right? <laughs> Babe! Babe. <laughs> You make this so f***ing difficult, it's so f***ing irritating. <laughs> Can you please let me go? This is my answer. I'm actually a really good person, but nobody understands because... You wanna know why? Are you listening? Pookie, can I have my phone, please? Pookie! Can I have my phone, please? You're just gonna ignore me like that. I'm, I'm like, I don't exist. <laughs> my boyfriend does the same thing. Babe! My wrist hurt. See, you can't even drive. You're drunk driving. You want to pull me over for drunk driving. You can't even stay in your lines. My family is the police. And you think that you're somebody and you're not. <laughs> you gotta 
going to make this so f***ing difficult. Oh my god, we're going to die this f***ing car. Babe. Babe. You just wanted to pull me over because you're like, oh my god, this hot in this f***ing white car. And you pull me over for no f***ing reason. What was your reason? Let me hear this right now on audio. What was your reason to pull me over, sir? Huh? I'm already What? I'm already What? Failure to what? Maintain your Okay, let me go. have been nice and respectful. You, on the other side, are mean. No, you're not a good person. No, 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 no. Let's not lie to each other. Come on, honey. What? What? Do you remember walking out of my before bar and not getting back in? Because I don't like you. I think you're a bad individual. You just think you're cool because you f***ing put me in your f***ing car? F***er, I will literally show the f*** out of you. Oh, you think you're cool because you arrested somebody in f***ing QS? <laughs> oh, baby boy. You have no idea, honey. You have no good idea. You're f***ing annoying. Like, I actually hate you. You're not a nice person, and I actually think you're terrible. And I probably will hit you in the f***ing face when I get out of here. You're not a nice person. I don't like you. I think you're a terrible person, actually. Sorry you feel that way. What? Sorry you feel that way. No, it's not I'm sorry you feel that way. You saw my boyfriend. It's a terrible excuse for a f***ing excuse. It's not nice. You pulled me over for no f***ing reason. You just wanted something to do. Oh, let me just pull over this car right now. Because I have nothing else to do with my entire life. Except sit here and be a f***ing idiot. Right? The suspect tried to divert the police with false claims, but the authorities paid no heed and proceeded with the legal proceedings. Can you take me home, please? Honey. Cookie! Can you take these off me, please? Going home. Your taxi is not that fucking comfy. I don't think you're a nice individual. I don't want to get a job. <laughs> you're not a nice person. Come on. You want to search it right here? On this one? Come on, that's good. Like, can you yes. take it? Oh, okay. Right. Let me just... Come on. Come on. We're good, control, we're good. Where? 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 Is that waste trap on? It's over there, so I'm sure you, you've never been in the trap before. Whatever you think you could be, thank you for the food. I don't know where. You're making the situation worse for yourself. You're gonna look back on this and realize you could have had a simple DUI and now you get now you stack charges and so so please just chill out. Hey, let me go, please. Oh god. How are you? Great. Good to hear. 
years. Well, uh, how does that work? I don't, you know, from the time you call yes. arrival. You ever had gum or anything like that? Do you have any dentures, false teeth, partial plates? Do you have any coins in your mouth, chewing gum, tobacco? Are you ill, sick, or injured? Do you know anything but this? Okay, there we go. Uh, that works. All right, so did they, uh, my job here is to administer the breath test, okay? So once the 20 minutes elapses, we'll get you out of there. We'll take you into the room with the breath test instrument. And uh, you'll decide if you, if you want to submit to a lawful test of your breath, okay? What does that mean? Okay. Okay. Do you have gum in your mouth? No. What's in your mouth? Do you have a tongue ring? Oh, can you open your mouth for me? Open up. Can you see inside your mouth, please? You have gum in your mouth. Why would you lie like that? Why do you think this is funny? It's all being recorded, and you know, should you take this to a jury trial, it's you know, your dishonesty is going to be noted. You know, there's no reason to act like that. You know, you, know, you made choices, so you're here because of, you know you get what you get because you did what you did, not because of anything we did to you. Okay, ma'am. Yeah, just wash your hand. Anything else in your mouth? No, ma'am. Ah. We're annoying? Yes. Why would you say that? Because we're annoying. Everybody's entitled to their opinion. See, you're going to make me laugh. You what? What? And you're accepted. Okay. I'm on a man. Listen. Probably not much you can say to me that I haven't already heard. All right. So, I'm requesting that you submit to a lawful test of your breath. Determine its alcohol content. Are you willing to submit to that test? No. Okay. I'm going to read to you what's called implied consent so you understand the penalties you'll be facing for refusing. Yes, she has. Yeah. Why does she have a blood Hey, Jessica, what's your photograph? Okay. 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 That's fine. I'm going to put that one because they'll mail everything to Tennessee. Uh, since that's the one on your driver's license, you're refusing to provide us a regular address. So make sure you have somebody who uh, is putting your mail there. Do you have an affirmative obligation to keep us updated with your address? As do you with the clerk of the court. So you won't have an excusable excuse if you don't get your notices for the court because you're refusing to provide us a current address. Also, my dad didn't take that in your report. I suspect your judge will be less uh, enthralled with your. Uh, lack of compliance, but you can explain it to him. Despite the police outlining her actions, legal consequences, she remained unconcerned about it. Judge Wilson, he's uh, an excellent judge and a very wise judge. And a former trooper, so he doesn't really take kindly to people acting like that. All right, so if you refuse to take the test I requested of you, your driving privilege will be suspended for a period of one year for a first refusal, or 18 months if your driving privilege has been previously suspended, or if you've been previously fined under section 327.35215 for refusing to submit to a lawful test of your breath, urine, or blood. Additionally, if you refuse to take the test I requested of you, and if your driving privilege has been previously suspended, or if you've been previously fined under section 327.35215 for refusal to submit to a lawful test of your breath, urine, or blood, you'll be committing a misdemeanor in addition to any other penalties which can be imposed by law. Refusal to submit to the test I requested is, an, is admissible into evidence in any criminal proceeding, which is what you're facing right now as a DUI is, is criminal. So do you understand what I've just read to you? Yes. And are you still refusing to submit to this test? Yes. Okay. Uh, Stefana, go right to the other and have a seat in the chair that you can see. Oh, I know. I was put in the back seat. Yeah. Well, so. now you know. Yeah, you actually didn't actually pay for not giving them the, uh, that key. They didn't ask me for it. I didn't say they did. I'm just letting you know. Giving you the courtesy of uh, okay. I'm glad you're playing your turn. You know, when you, you act certain ways, you know, you just you know, I'm not saying you for you. Knock it off. Knock it off now. Do you hear me? Have a seat or you go back in that chair. Do you understand? Yes or no? Answer me out loud. Stand here, take your stuff off. Anything electronic. 
Stand here. First off, nothing was said to me about I don't give a, I don't give a crap whether it was or not. Of course you don't. You're gonna have a seat. Of course you don't. You're gonna have a seat. First off, you're gonna have to yeah. No, oh, for goodness sakes. It's on the camera, so I don't know. It is, you're right. Yeah, it is. Watch your foot. As if my knees were in my mouth. We don't care. Oh, you do. You do care. You do care. You're for no reason. Let me see. You're for no reason. Just stand here. Yeah. In the midst of the legal process, the woman made an unforeseen move, which required the police to respond immediately. Oh, I'm recording! Y'all might take this in! Mm, what? Mm. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. 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 You're disobeying lawful orders right now. That's not. How am I disobeying lawful orders? Did they tell you to sit there? Yeah, every time. I am sitting that here. That is a lawful order. Every yes. time you try every to stand up, you, that's a new charge. Every time you try to every stand up, time. that is disobeying the lawful order to sit down. So when we have to put our hands on you, every time there's a new charge of resisting. You're making it and worse. And the judge is going to see this, and the judge is going to agree with us. He's not going to agree with you. You can smile all you want, man. It's just the law. And I'm sure it's the same way in Tennessee because I've been there many years and I know many law enforcement officers in Nashville, Tennessee, they'll agree with me too. And this ain't Broadway. I tried to warn you when you came through the door. Just comply, man, and chill out. Uh, just make sure she doesn't take me. That's a lot of money. Hey, honey, I'm actually down the Cross your leg. Cross your leg. Yeah. All right, Jessica, are you going to provide a sample of your breath? No. Right. Oh, my own, I want my purse, and I want my house. Okay. So. You're getting none of those things until you see the judge tomorrow. Okay. Whatever. Have a seat. Do not get up. Don't hurt my breath. Man, if you would listen to us. Stop we would not have to be hands on with you. Okay. But you don't want to listen. And that's why your mouth it's is going to get you more trouble. 
recording, it right? Is. As well as the audio of us telling you to stop resisting. And I'm not resisting! Okay. You're hurting me! A lawful order. You're hurting me! Hey man, that's it. Finish off your ass and, and stop. Oh, I can't get up? No! Oh. I can't get up? No! Oh. We told you to sit down. The f out of my Okay. This ain't gonna go well for you, ma'am. Trust me. Because once, once we get clear from the nurse, you're in our charge. And guess what? Mm -hmm. We're a lot meaner than they are. They're a lot nicer than us. Alright, you're gonna need them before they're gonna need you. Our <laughs> charge. There you go. No, you just woke up. Yeah, no, it's still wrong. Yeah. I'm just gonna wait for this to run and then. That way yeah. she can't say later that we didn't. down off or whatever, you know, and I realize you made it a lot harder than it had to be and a lot worse for yourself. Yeah. Okay. How you doing? I've been done. Yeah, it's just one more thing. One more diagnostic. Yeah, I don't know if I'll do a, another two minute one. I just rushed. Not if you hit refusal. Okay. If you hit the R, it'll, it'll just roll through. And mark it all this way if you Yeah, we'll just roll it that way again. Well, it's all on TikTok. <laughs> I've been on YouTube for doing my job before. Guess what? I still wear the badge. I've already got all her information off of that. Do you want to straight back out when we're ready, or what? Um, what do you want to do? Um, sorry to this up to you. How do you want to win? Good as soon as I hit this R, we need to get out of the way. I'll take it. Okay, so it's good. You're good. Warms are free. You're good. You're good now. You're good whenever. The woman was charged with DUI, resisting officer, obstruction without violence, and refusing to sign citation. In a dramatic turn of events, the former cop's granddaughter found herself face to face with the law, her intoxicated drive ending in a classic case of poetic justice. Yeah, when, before when we went to the bar, I had one drink, the Malibu Bay Breeze, and yep. when we went to his house, I had one Nicola Ultra beer, that was it. Okay. And you think you're okay to drive right now? I'm definitely fine. Okay. All right. So, what I'm seeing, you're not okay to drive. On May 14th, 2022, police observed Gianna, whose car failed to stop at a red light at the intersection, and they conducted a traffic stop in Wildwood Crest. As the cops interacted with Gianna and asked for her details, they detected a suspicious odor coming from her car, which raised multiple red flags. Where are you guys headed? We're headed home right now. Okay. Where's I home? live on. Okay. Yeah. Where are you guys coming from? We're coming from um, our friend's house on uh, Wildwood Crest. Wildcrest? Yeah. In Wildcrest? Yeah, Danny's house. Where's what shoes on again? Uh, I just picked my friend up from there. He wasn't feeling good. <laughs> Who are all these people? Is this all the same guy? No, this. These yeah, these, that's my grandpa. He's a uh, retired police officer in Gloucester Township in New Jersey. Okay. South Jersey. Yeah. These are all his. Yeah. Gotcha. And then a close family friend as well. Got oh, this. There's some. Clyde, yeah, he's a close family friend. He's a state trooper in Williamstown. Okay. Yep. All right. And you're going where? We're going back to my house in um. What are you guys doing tonight? We're just going home, going to bed. Yeah. Yeah. You guys out? At the bars? No, I was just picking my friend up. He wasn't feeling good, so we're just dropping him off at my house. Gotcha. Yeah. All right. Give me a couple minutes. All right. Okay. No Very back with you. Charlie four nine seven county. Charlie Just add a New Jersey deal.
Alright, Gianna. How much have you drank tonight? Um, like one drink, that's it. Just one? Yeah. Because when I'm talking to you, I, I don't know if it's everybody else or I, I can smell alcohol coming out of the car. Okay. Alright. Um, we don't have any alcohol in the car. No, no, no. That's, yeah. that's fine. I, I can smell like alcohol coming out. So I don't know if it's you or other people in the car. Yeah. But what I want to do, I want to make sure you're okay to drive, okay? Okay. So what I want you to do, can you just step out of the car for me and I want to run you through a couple tests? Sure. Alright. The police carried out specific tests on the suspect to resolve their doubts and evaluate her condition. You just had one? Yes. How long ago was that? Can you step up on the other side? Hours ago. What's that? A couple hours ago. Okay. Right up here on the sidewalk. Can you just timestamp sobriety testing, please? Hang out with this officer for a second. I gotta turn off my lights. Nice and flat. So it was a couple hours ago? Yes. What was it? We were just hanging out at. No, what, what was the uh, drink you had? Uh, Malibu Bay Breeze. Okay. And that was a few hours ago at yeah. the bar? Mm -hmm. Okay. Alright, so what, do you have anything wrong with your eyes? I wear contacts. Okay. Anything other than that that would keep you from performing an eye test? I had an eye infection like a week ago, but I just wear contacts. That's okay. it. Yeah, that should be fine. Okay. You, you think you can perform this? Yeah. Alright, so what I want you to do stand with your feet together and arms down at your side. Just like this for me, all right? So what I want you to do, follow the tip of my pen right okay. here with your eyes and your eyes only, okay? okay. Don't move your uh, head at all okay. and just follow with your eyes. Do you understand? Yes. All right. Moving your head, all right? Just keep your head okay. right on me. Sorry. And then follow with your eyes, all right? All right, a little bit longer, I'm sorry. All right, one more time. Alright, I'm gonna go up now, okay? Same okay. thing, don't move your head. Alright, I have two more tests for you. Um, okay. Is there anything wrong with your legs or anything? Do you have any injuries? Well, Keep you from. That's about it. <laughs> <laughs> no injuries or anything? Nope. So nothing that would keep you from performing a balance test? Not to my awareness, no. All right, so see this line right here? Okay. What I want you to do, put your left foot on that line. Do you want to take off? the right, or? Yeah, yeah, so I'll take left foot on the line, okay. right foot in front of your left, just like that. Like this? Yep, okay. arms down at your side, all right? So what I want you to do, stay like that, all right, while I explain the test. What I want you to do, when I tell you, I want you to take nine heel-to-toe steps up this line, okay? And 
when you get to your nine step, you're going to keep your front foot planted. You're going to take a series of small steps and take nine heelless toe steps back. The whole time, you're going to count each step out loud, okay? And if at any time you, like, stop or anything like that, just continue where you left off, okay? So you want me to take nine forward, nine back? Yep, I'm going to show it to you right now. I'm not going to do a full nine. I'm only going to do three, okay? okay. Stay like that for me. Yep. All right, so it's going to look like this. One, two, three. You get to nine. This is my, this is my nine. Keep your front foot planted. Series of small steps just like this. Nine back. One, two, three. Okay? Sorry, I'm just like, really cold right Do now. you have a jacket in there that you want? I can I grab it for you. So, no. no? All right. So I'm just a little bit shaky because I'm cold. No, I understand. So do you, you understand? Yes. Okay. okay. All right. You ready? Yes. All right, you can begin. One, two. Heel to toe. Three, four, five, six, Nine. Yep, what did I tell you to do? And then backwards? Nope, take that. This way? Uh huh. Right. One, two, sorry, I'm really cold right now. I understand. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Okay, I have one more test for you, alright? I know, it's it's cold. Um, are your legs still okay? Yeah, just wasn't anticipating a jacket, so I apologize. Yeah, I know. I'm sorry. Do they, does anybody else have one we can grab for you? No. no. When the police conducted the final tests on the suspect, the outcomes drove them to implement immediate and decisive measures. So what I want you to do is just stand with your feet together. Why don't you come up here where it's there, you got a little crack there. I want, it, I want you to be on the most level surface. All right, feet together, arms down to your side for me. All right. When I tell you to begin the test, I want you to pick up either foot, left or right, whichever one you feel more comfortable with, six inches off the ground, okay? okay. You're going to keep your front foot, or you're going to keep that toe pointed out, all right, six inches off the ground. The whole time, you're going to look at your foot, all right? Okay. Keep your feet down, or arms down at your side, and you're going to count out loud 1,001, 1,002, 1,003, 1,004, and so on, until I tell you to stop, okay? okay. It's going to look like this, all right? 1,001, 1,002, 1,003, 1,004, 1,005, 1,006, 1,007. So you're just standing on one leg? Yep, six inches. So just like that, six inches off the ground. Keep your eyes on, on your foot, okay? And if at any time, say you put your foot down, just pick it right back up and continue where you left off, okay? okay. Do you understand? Yes. Okay, give me a second. I'll tell you when to begin. It's a little shaky. I'm sorry. No, I understand. It, it's cold out here and it just started raining out of nowhere. All right, you ready? Yes. All right, you can begin. Six inches. Two. Just like I showed you. Yep, six inches off the ground, just like this. Sorry. Yep. I'm sorry, I'm really shaky because I'm just cold. I know. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Keep your arms down at your side for me. Nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21. Okay, you can put it down. All right. So, how much have you actually had to drink tonight? Just one to two drinks, that's Just it. Just the one to two yep. now? So was it one, two, or was it? Just one drink, yeah. Okay, well then you just said one to two. Yeah, when, before when we went to the bar, I had one drink, the Malibu Bay Breeze, and yep. when we went to his house, I had one Miklo Ultra beer. That was it. Okay. And you think you're okay to drive right now? I'm definitely fine. Okay. All right. So, what I'm seeing, you're not okay to drive. Okay? okay. So, you have to come back with us at the place in handcuffs. You're under arrest for driving while intoxicated. Okay? Okay. Right. I think morning. that was just a little bit shaky, and that was affecting my... No, well, no. I'll explain more later, but... The uh, I'll explain more. We have we'll have time to talk, but let me get my pen in my pocket. Okay. All right. So come over here to this car. Nine seven county. Charlie four nine seven. And have one four four fifty. All right. Just put your hand behind your back for me. Yeah. Bro. I need a job. Fair enough. Is anybody in that car sober? Yeah, my um, friend in the passenger seat. Why wasn't she driving? Let me 
double lock these so they don't get any tighter on there, right? Do you have anything on you? No, then it doesn't look like it. Alright, you're just hopping in here, alright? Do you want your seatbelt on? Okay, yes. Do you do? Alright, um, I'm gonna go around and grab it for you. I don't wanna reach around, alright? Ferguson, come here. Open this door over here. Open, open her door. Did you just put this on her? I don't want to reach around her. Thank you, officer. Thank you for being cooperative. Has your passengers been drinking, too? At that point, the police carried out a search of the suspect's vehicle to find any evidence that could incriminate her. You guys have an Uber or something that come pick you um, up? I can walk to my buddy's house. He's like right around the block. He's right around the block? Yeah. How about you? Uh, she, she'll come yeah. up All right. Uh, where does he live? Uh, I have the address. All right. Yeah, he's right Which is like the block, like down that, just around the corner, like on the opposite yeah, side. Yeah, we're talking about getting down something like that. All right. Yeah, you guys. Uh, start walking. Yeah, yeah. start. Sorry. Because it's gonna get towed, all right? Yeah. Is this our this our phone? Yeah. Because she has to get towed because she's arrested for. It. Do you want? Is this her purse? Her purse? That's just her purse. This is her purse. Yeah, you probably want to. Good. You got about a uh, 20 minute ETA for Kimball. 10 foot. Mark. It's just a lot of like a push start. That's a push start? Yeah. Does she have her key? You know where it's at? Um, she might have it on her. I'm not really sure. Yeah, it's like a key fob. It's either on her or... It's on her. Okay. Is this getting too... 5 to yeah. Charlie 97. Really? Yeah, it's getting too... Because for 450. Does she have the car keys on her? They yeah, they said it's it's in the car, so her key fob? The, yeah, the key fob. It should be here. This is how she starts her car. Oh just you check that they're in your uh, pocketbook. Ten four. Okay. All right, you guys are gonna. Yeah, no, we're gonna just, we're gonna walk past them. Okay. Do, Do you want to hear take her belongings? Cause yeah, yeah, I can. Thank you. I don't see the key fob in here. It should be with her. It's either in here. Or it's in her pocket. Cause she's they she's they said that. She doesn't have it, so she, they're gonna need it for the towel. That's so what? either in her car or on her purse. She said it was in her purse. You guys want to just help me look real quick before I don't want to go search, search in her car. What? What? Wait. Okay. Probably What do you need? 
the key fob. Okay. I just don't want to go search on it. Here's her, her purse. It's not in here. It wouldn't be in mine. I think she has it. She has. Make sure it didn't fall out. Watch it. I think she would have it in her pocket because she wouldn't keep it like on her pocket or anything. Her. In her pocket book, she wouldn't have it in her pocket book. Police moved forward with their actions, ensuring that the suspect would face the repercussions of her misconduct. You guys have a far walk? No, no it's right down the block on the left. Um, so, I guess she maybe has it, or... Check my purse, but I don't think she would ever give me. Yes, sir. Why did it fell down in her seat? Uh, possibly, but she has a key to like her key fob in this console right here, and it's not here. Oh wait, hold on, here it is. Found it. Yeah, I did. All right, oh. All right we found it. All right, thanks. Sir. She usually keeps it in here or here, so it's right here. All right. Do you need it? Yeah, we do for the tail. Yeah, yeah. Thank you guys. Yeah, of course. Well, have a good night, alright? Get home safe. Yeah, it's fine. Can I just grab anything that's in here that she might need? Yeah. Like, okay. Well, the insurance and all will be able to. Yeah. Because she'll have to come to the station to get the tail release anyway. That, that's easy. Come get you, alright?
here, it's calling me. Uh, should I answer it? Yeah. She said it's in her pot. It's in her pocket book. Uh, pocket book. She said. And it's not on it right now at all. She said. Uh, they said that the keys aren't in the car. Right. You're gonna fall into this. Uh, She's uh, a deal right now. But, we'll but she said that it was in the um, in the car. So in her pocketbook. All right. All right. Alright. Gianna was charged with operating under the influence, careless driving, and failure to observe traffic control device. In a twist of irony, the cop's sister found herself on the wrong side of the law, her night ending with a sobriety test instead of a celebratory toast. Hey, I'm really not. So what we're going to do is uh, we are, I am going to have to place you under arrest. You're going to come inside, we're going to fill out some paperwork, and then uh, you're going to need someone to pick you up, all right? Wait, wait. Right. I'm not! So, so for now, just do me a favor, just go ahead and put your hands behind your back, alright? On May 2nd, 2024, around midnight, while patrolling Middletown Township, police observed Asma's car swerving between lanes on multiple occasions. When the police approached Asma, they initially gathered details from her for further inquiry. However, her demeanor aroused their doubts. Just the uh, registration too, if you have it. Oh, I have no idea where it is. This is like a kid car. Uh, let's find it. Four one two three nine four sixteen. I'm out with the. Whose car is it? That's mine. Um, sorry. Well, I mean, it's not registered to you, though, right? Oh, yeah, no, it's my father. Okay. Siobhan, gotcha. Yeah. All right, yeah, you can keep looking for it. Just the reason I'm stopping you, uh, you're kind of swerving back there. I mean, uh, you went into the, the other lane, and then I had my lights on for about, like, a minute, and you weren't stopping. Oh, I'm just going home. I have work tomorrow. Okay. I went for a work event. Where, where do you go for a work event? Um, we went to Charlie's and Lincoln's, and then I went to Gabriella's okay. for a little bit. And I'm going home. My okay. kids are at my mom's, and I'm just going home, and Got then I'm going to go to work tomorrow. Like gotcha. Then. Is there any reason that you didn't pull over right away when I had the lights on? I honestly, I didn't see until I looked up, and then I saw your lights, and okay. then I pulled over. All right. Were you on your phone or something? Or? No. Yeah. I'm, I'm literally, my house is right there. Okay. Yeah. All right. I live uh, have you had anything to drink tonight? Um, when I went out for dinner, I had a glass of wine. Okay. With my filet mignon, that was it. Okay, nothing at Gabriella's? Uh, no. I just went with my co-worker. We went to just hang out, and uh, I'm like, I'm going home because I have work tomorrow. Okay. I have to take my kids to the school, and then... Gotcha. Who's the, uh, who's this card from? My, oh, that's my brother. Your brother? Okay. Okay. Yep. All right, just give me a second. All also, right. uh, just make sure you put your seatbelt on, so you don't have your seatbelt on. Okay. All right. Okay, thanks. Uh, not really, but I, she was like kind of like swerving out like when I was behind her and then I had my, I literally had my lights on from uh, probably back by, like right when you come over the hill, I got Apple Farm and then like she finally stopped here. <laughs> yeah, she's like, oh, I, I, I didn't see the lights. I'm like, I did not see these lights. But uh, let me see what's going on with her real quick. Yeah, hey, I'm good. What's up? Uh, I don't see what I'm that's the thing. Uh, We'll see you inside. Let me check her license stuff real quick. Oh, 
Hey, man. How are you? Where'd you say you're coming from again? Gabriel's. Oh, Gabriel's? Okay. Yeah. Gotcha. What were you doing over there? Um, so I went for a work event at Charlie's okay. and Moon Cross, and okay. then me and my co-worker were like, okay, let's go to Gabriel's for a little bit. Gotcha. My kids are at my mom's. Okay. And I'm, I'm just going home because I have work. Night out. Now. Okay. I got gotcha. you. I got gotcha. you. What do you do for work? Um, I just started, actually. I work for... Yeah, so we went out for because somebody at work retired. Okay. So I'm like taking her position. So okay. How do you like it, it over there? Nice. Yeah, it's nice. Yeah? Yeah. Okay. I'm a, a single mom. I just got divorced a year right. ago. Sorry so to hear like, that. No. Oh. So I'm, I'm doing, I feel like, you know, I'm just having a, I'm, you know, I'm just going home. No, I, I, I got you. I have to go mean. to sleep and I got to wake up to go to work tomorrow. Okay. I got you. The suspect concocted excuses to conceal her condition from the police, but the officer delved further into the matter. Okay. All right. All right. How are you? Doing all right. Not too bad. About to get off work, so that's good. Not too bad. I, I feel like you guys, like, I, my brother's a cop, so I feel like you guys, like, you guys like to, like, get together and then, like, you know, I don't know. Well, there's just a lot of us out here at the moment, just because we're on shift change. Oh. So midnight's are just getting on the road, the evening's is getting off. Oh. So we're all kind of, we got some downtime right now, so right. that's why there's a lot of us out here right now, yeah. What, um, where are you from? What, your... Where am I from? Yeah. I'm from, like, up north. Oh, up like, north? Woodbridge area. Oh, okay. Yeah. Yeah. Yep. Got to be up early for work tomorrow or no? Uh, so I, no, I have to get my kids from my mom's. So okay. But like, but I like gotcha. But I yeah. usually get up early anyway. Yeah, yeah. It's not too bad though. Yeah. You said you just started working for that company? Um, actually, after my holiday, I'm Muslim, so like okay. Ramadan. Okay. Um, they gave me my my holiday, and then I started April 10th. Okay. Yeah. Well, that's I good. Mean, I really like it. Yeah. All right. So you're going out about a month. Yeah. Oh, yeah nice. I need thirty one four five. Put me on the back for three eighty. You know what? You don't realize that you're like unemployed. Yeah. Like, yeah. You feel like you're like, what am I doing? Yeah, yeah. And so like, once I found the job, I was really happy. Okay. You're unemployed for a little bit. I was unemployed for like. Five months. Oh, oh really? Okay. Yeah. What were you doing before that? I worked for an EMS company. Okay. Oh, okay. Okay. Oh, yeah? So I was there like three years. Oh, wow. I'm sorry to hear that. Yeah, no, no opportunities. Yeah, yeah, 100%. I just got divorced a year ago, so like I said, I'm good. Okay. Were, uh, were you able to find that, that registration form? Oh, no, I didn't. Uh, I know it's here. Where, where is it? 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 Where is it
and uh, are, are you comfortable with shoes? I'm not making you walk at all, so are, are you okay to stand no. in those shoes? Okay. No, all, right. all right. The police were applying a specific method in the case, but the suspect attempted to use a trick to sidestep the situation. Um, I have prescription. Yeah. You wear contacts, contacts glasses? Yeah. Okay. All right. Are you wearing them now? Yeah. Okay. All right. So what I need to do is just, uh, can you see the tip of this pen? Yeah. All right. Just uh, keep your head still and just follow the tip of your, uh, can you just keep your hands at your sides? Mm. Just uh, follow the tip of my pen with your eyes and uh, don't move your head at all. Okay? Understand? You understand? Yeah, I understand. Okay. Almost done. All right, and just follow it straight up, okay? With your eye. Just uh, keep your head, keep your chin down. All right. And just... Okay. So, uh, how do you pronounce your first name? A Asma. Asma. Okay. Uh, be honest with me, how much did you really have to drink tonight? We, I had two glasses of wine at Charlie's, okay. and then I came to Gabriella's, and they were giving like everybody like like the birthday like, mm -hmm. and then they gave everybody like a champagne. I had a sip, okay. and I sat there the whole time. My friend was talking to somebody, and I sat there the whole time, and then I left. Okay. Yeah. All right. So, uh, yeah, your eyes are telling me a little bit different that you had more than two glasses of wine. All right. Mm -hmm. I really didn't. Okay. So I'm going to have you do okay. two more tests, all right? We're okay. going to go into this parking lot because it's flat over there. If you want to take your shoes off, you can. Uh, if no, it's easier for you to walk it. disgusting. I don't want okay. to. Okay. Do you have other shoes in your car that aren't yeah, heels? Yeah, I have flats. Okay. All right. Where are they? Yeah, just go right on. Right in the front. Yeah, just go on the side of the car. This side. This side. This side, man. No, they're they're on, like, my okay, side. Okay. If, if you could reach over. Just so I don't want you standing in the middle of the highway here. Okay. Um, you, I don't want to touch them. Can I just slip them on? You have, don't want to touch them? Yeah, because I have germophobia. Uh, can I just like slip them? Do you want me to grab them out of the car yeah, for you? you wanna... can go. Okay, just They're stand, like just stand uh, over here on the side. They're I don't want white. you to get hit by a car. Where are they in the back of the front? No, they're on the front by my side. On my the... side. Yeah, on the floor. We're just gonna, okay, uh, when you grab them the heels, I'm gonna put them back in the car. Yeah, that's fine. All right, we're just gonna go right uh, next to where these cars are over here. It's just uh, two tests I need to do real quick, and then we'll go from there. All right, so we're gonna use this line right here so you can stand right okay. here. Okay. Um, uh, st no, stand facing me. Stand, okay. And take like a couple steps back. Okay. All right. So uh, what I'm gonna do is pl place your left foot on the line, all right, and place your right foot in front of your left, all right and your hands down your sides and just stay just like that while I explain the test, okay? Don't just stay in that position, don't do anything until I tell you to do otherwise. Alright, you understand? Just touch a uh, heel to toe. Alright, just like that with your hands at your sides and just stay just like that, alright? So with this for this test I'm gonna have you take nine steps down this line, alright? On every step I want you to touch heel to toe and you're gonna count each step out loud, alright? You're also gonna keep your hands down at your sides. So when you get to your ninth step, you're going to turn around by keeping your fr front foot on the on the line, and you're going to take a series of small steps to turn around and go nine steps back. All right, I'm going to I'm going to show you how to do it real quick. So if this is the line right here, you're going to have your left foot on the line, right foot in front of it. You're going to do one, two, three. When you get to the ninth step, you're going to keep this foot, front foot on the on the line. Okay, are you listening to me? You don't have to look at him. All right, just listen to me. All right, you can keep that line, that foot on the line. 
Then you're gonna turn around just like this. Take a couple steps and turn around, and then nine steps back. One, two, three, all the way to nine. Okay? Do you understand that? Yeah. All right, do you, do you need me to explain it again, or you got it? Okay. Well, I, I want you to be sure that you got it before you start, so. Is there any, any questions at all? No? No questions? Are you sure? Yeah. Because you, you don't seem sure. No, I'm fine. I, I know you're saying you're fine, but I need to do the test, okay? Do you understand the test? No. Okay, all right. So if you understand the test, you can begin. Okay, so we said one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and I'll turn. One, two, three, four, All right. The police continued with the remaining procedures, but unfortunately, the outcome did not favor the woman. The next test I'm going to have you do is you're going to stand with your, uh, you can step towards me. All right, you're going to stand with your feet together, all right, and hands down at your sides. All right, when I tell you to, you're going to pick one leg of your choice. It could be your left or your right. Okay. You're going to pick it up approximately six inches off the ground with your foot pointed forward, just like that. Okay. All right, you're going to look down at your foot, and you're going to count like this. 1,001, 1,002, 1,003 and so on until I tell you to stop. Oh, okay. All right, don't okay. don't start until oh. I tell you to do. Yeah, yeah. You understand the test? Yeah. All right. Thanks. All right, you can begin. Okay, um, 1,001, 1,002, 1,003, 1,004. Just pick your uh, foot up a little higher. 1,005, 1,006, 1,007, 1,008, 1,009, 1,010, 1,011, 1,012, 1,013, 1,014, 2017, 2018, 2019, 2020. Should I keep going? Yep, that's what I tell you to stop. 2021, 2022, 1,023, 1,024, 1,025, All right, you're good. Okay. All right. So, uh, so based off what I'm seeing, I feel like you are under the influence, okay? All right. I'm really not. So what we're going to do is uh, we are. I am going to have to push you into arrest. You're going to come inside. We're going to fill out some paperwork, and then uh, you're going to need someone to pick you up, all right? But, but, uh, all I'm right. not. So, so for now, just do me a favor. Just go ahead and put your hands behind your back, all right? Just uh, place your palms out outwards. Do you have anything in uh, in your pockets at all that I should know about? No, okay. All right. You can uh, come come right back this way. Do you have someone that could uh, pick you up from the? Nope, I don't. No one at all. No, I don't. Okay. So if uh, just, if you don't have anyone to pick you up, you're gonna have to stay there for 12 hours, just so you know. So just come back right back to this car back here. if she needs her phone or anything. Ma'am, is your phone in the car or purse that you need? You said yes? Okay, uh, where is it in the car? Do you, you need your purse, right, and your phone so you can call somebody? Okay, you'll, you'll be out of there before they have to go to school. As long, it takes about an hour to 45 minutes to an hour to process you, and then you'll be out, all right? Do you want me to grab your phone? I don't know if that's 
how you feel. Uh, man, it's not up to me. It's up to you. You're the one who's going to have to call someone to pick you up. I don't have anybody to pick me up. I'm a single mother and I'm going home to go to sleep to go... Okay, I understand that. Do you want your phone so you can have someone to call to pick up, pick you up? It's not doing me a favor by getting your phone or not. Okay, all right, so I'm not going to grab it then. It's going to get, it's going to go with your car when your car gets towed, okay? If you don't want your phone. All right. Good. Uh, she said she doesn't want any of her stuff out of the car, so I mean, I'm just going to leave it in there. She's... Sounds good. Yeah. Tough. Due to unforeseen circumstances, the police conducted additional tests for further evaluation. Second open door. Okay. And, uh, Hi, stand by right here. Okay. I'll be right here. Right over here. Okay. So, um, I see your driver's license real quick if you have it with you. Did you have to drive all the way down here from Bayonne? Sorry? Did you have to drive here from Bayonne? Yeah. Oh, okay. I didn't know that was that far. I thought you were locally. <laughs> okay. That's what my friends are for. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I don't want to get her in trouble at work, so. Yeah. Yeah. Question. Yep. Um, on my way here, I kind of had some trouble because the roads, some of the roads are closed. Mm -hmm. So, like, how is that going to work out? When I, leave? We're trying I, to get, yeah. I actually had, like, one of the, um, like, I guess one of those supervisors, he had to, like, leave me in here. Okay. Where, uh, where are you trying to go back to the parkway? The parkway and okay. then I, I, I don't know. I got to drop her off to Home Dell and then. Yeah, so uh, what exit on the parkway did you get off of? 114. Uh, 114. Okay, and there was a road closed on the way? Yeah, that? they they had some construction or something okay. like that. So, um, and then, like, I literally, because I think they had um, some pavement. Going yeah, on. you can get on the parkway at uh, 117. If you, okay. like, after you drop her off, just keep going north on 35. Sure. And okay. then uh, you'll you'll see the, the signs for the okay. parkway. Okay, right, thank you. I appreciate it. All right, so, um, yeah, she got arrested for driving under the influence, I guess, wherever she was tonight. She had a couple drinks. Yeah, we had a retirement party. Yeah, so, um, if you want to just read this over real quick okay. uh am i in trouble no no you're not in trouble at all no you're just picking her up so technically you're taking like responsibility for her from this point on sure. until uh okay so no okay she doesn't uh, have her car so she can't drive it but yeah yeah here you go thank you so, so much. uh i just need you to sign right here okay after you read that okay. i don't have to go to court though right? no no okay. So, yeah, all this is saying I'm is just that, picking her up. Yeah, you're just picking her up okay, and you're just making just sure that she doesn't drive okay. tonight. Okay. All right. All right. It sounds, I mean, worse than it does. It sounds yeah, when you intimidating. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> so, like, no, it's just saying that. Uh, okay. All right. As long as I don't have to go to court, no, I'm just no, picking no. her up. Yep. We're cool. All right. Okay. Here you go. Thanks right. so much. No problem. Yeah, so, I'll just go. Uh, I, I was in bed and everything. Like. Yeah. I apologize about that. <laughs> ASMA was issued the following summonses. Operating under the influence, consent to take breath samples, reckless driving, failure to wear seatbelt in traffic on marked lanes. 
Uncover the moment that sidetracked to this woman's ambitious journey to become a police officer. I told you to hang up, you didn't. I told you to get out, you didn't. Stop pulling away. Yes, you are. You're pulling away. Yes, you are. On March 3rd, 2024, the officer stopped a woman suspected of driving under the influence in Florida. The officer gave some orders, but the woman's tough antics created a tricky situation. Hi. The occupant almost fell. How are you? You know what? You almost no. fell over there. No. Yeah. I'm saying my my girl. What's that? I'm saying my girl. Your what? Right. My girl. Turn that off. Of course. Sir. All right. And go ahead and hang up. Where are the I'm not hanging up. I need okay, you to hang up. I'm not hanging up. Okay. I'm telling you to hang up. I'm not hanging up. Okay. okay. So I'm going to tell you one more time, and then we're going to change the way this is for going. For my safety, I'm okay. not hanging up. I'm going to so, put my phone. No. Hang up the phone. I'm, I will Copy. not. I'm about to put you in handcuffs. For what? For not obeying a I lawful know. order. And what floor is that true? 7-7, seven, seven. can I get another? Sir. Get off. Get off. Get off. The golf cart. Get off. Get off. I can't. I'm not resisting. But you were. I told you to hang up. You didn't. I told you to get out. You didn't. Stop pulling away. Yes, you are. You're pulling away. Yes, you are. Yes, you are. Yeah, go ahead. What's that? I know Florida side troops. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Good for you. Thank you. Are you here alone? Somebody staying with you? I know my Florida side troops. Mm. Okay. Have I you know my amendments. You know your amendments? I do. Yeah, good. So have you had anything to drink tonight? I saw you I saw you almost fall off of your off of your scooter there. Really? Oh. Yeah. I don't know, that's what I'm trying to find out from you. I want to make sure you're okay. If that's the case. And then you yeah. stopped in the crosswalk over there. When you were coming to the red light. So well, are you... so calm and so collected right now, right? No. I'm You're not. not. Mm -hmm. Am I leaning? Okay, okay. Are, are you, are you not feeling well? Are you leaning? Yeah. Yeah. Well, yeah, you're leaning against the car. <laughs> no, like, to the side. The woman found herself in hot waters, and to get out of it, she said something surprising. Who? Oh, really? Yeah, it's really, yeah, it's funny. Like, Sergeant Boy, Boy? Well, why, would, why would we call that, why would we call Sergeant Boy? Call him, and you'll find out. <laughs> that's, I'm not going to wake him up at 4 in the morning. Oh, I bet you won't, because that's what, y'all are all, all out of pocket. Why are we out of pocket? You know what? I'm going to relax. Why are we out of pocket? I'm going to relax. This this way, can check the problem. Why are we out of pocket? Call boy William. Why do I? I'm not. I don't have to listen. You don't dictate what happens here. I'm not dictating anything. You are. Just, you're trying I'm to demand saying, that I call somebody that I'm I don't have. I'm giving up suggestions. Okay. Well, we're in the city. I don't have to call anybody. Okay. Florida statues. What about Florida statues? You tell me about that. I don't have to. You're the one bringing it up. Go ahead. Go ahead. What? Yep. <clears throat> Because every single one of you are. What about get every single one of us? How are we going to get fed up? Ask Boyd Williams. You, you won't know until you call him. Okay. I'm not calling him at 4 in the morning. I bet you won't, but I will. Correct. I'm not. You want to take me to the jail? Probably. I'm glad. Because I'm not going to sit there. Still first appearance, yeah, it's normally how it works. That's how it works. 
you have anything on you that you're not supposed to have? Nope. Any guns, drugs, nope. knives, any contraband? Nope. Once you get to jail, you have something, it turns into a felony. Anything. Okay, it's a fair warning we give everybody. I don't have anything. Okay. Is there any use of force or anything? Uh, no. no. She just resisted. Okay. She's going for resisting and mm -hmm. something yeah. else. I'm, I'm not resisting. Not anymore. Not anymore. When did I resist? I mean, I wasn't here, but I'm going to take a wild you guess. You wasn't here, exactly my point. Okay, when so, did you, I resist? so you can I'm direct take a wild to guess and say that it was when guess? you were stopped. That's wild. It is. That it's is a wild, wild guess, correct? Right. Wild, yeah. Right. All right, so I believe I they're going to put resisting. you in a boat. Okay, well, you're going to be. Put... Be I know. I'm not right. moving. Come so on, you are. You are moving. You are going to get in the car. We're going to put you in the car. Call a deputy overton. Okay. And call. Even though the woman was studying to join the police force and should have understood the procedures, she kept causing issues. All right, young lady, going to stand up for me? And we're going to walk over here. And do what? We're gonna walk over here and you're gonna sit in that chair. I need you to walk. I'll sit in the chair. Okay, this chair right over here. All right. Thank you. All right. So, listen, I believe that you are under either alcohol or some kind of intoxicant that is affecting your normal motor skills. I understand. Okay. So that being said, and your eyes, the glassy and watery, your speech very slowed, you're I slumping, know. okay, and I can smell alcohol coming off your breath. I so that being said, would you like to participate in some field sobriety exercises to dispel my belief that Honestly, you are intoxicated. Yes, but I can also tell you I have only because I'm not going to lie to you, which is why I've been asking to ask for Deputy Hoverson and Sergeant Williams at the same time. Okay. They're my direct supervisors. Okay. I'm going through the academy. I would like for them to be here. Okay. I'm going to be here for Okay, so that's not how it so works. So I wouldn't know. It, it, it is not. It, it is it exactly is how it works. No. Then they must not have lied to me then. Not at all. No, they have lied to me if that's not how it works. Well, I can't attest for what they told you, but all I know is that your normal faculties seem impaired to me. So I'm asking you, I'm do you want anything. to participate in field sobriety exercises? Would they be here? No, it's going to be you and I and Officer Thornborough. He's on his way right here, now. Okay, so that's your right. So you're refusing field sobriety exercises. Is that I'm correct? Not, I'm not denying anything, but if they're not going to be here, then no. Okay, so. It's just going to be you and I and Officer Thurnborough. Yeah, my direct So, job. so if do you want to participate in field sobriety exercises? If my direct supervisor is not going to be here, then I already explained that she's if not. If my direct supervisor no. is not going to be here, nobody's going to be here except him and I. If my direct she seems to think that her direct supervisor is supposed to be here. If my direct supervisor is not going to be here, no. Okay, Who's so direct supervisor, deputy officer. So she's she's refusing. So. Field sobriety exercises. Well, she's not going to be here. Or Sergeant Boyd Williams. Well, he's not going to be here either. So she just yeah, uh, refused. So it's just you're not entitled to have them here. Yeah. I I'm not entitled. I, I get this. Mm -hmm. I'm going through the academy right now. I get that. That's why Hoverson's your direct chain of command. Yeah. Yeah. But I'm not doing anything without them here. Okay. Well, they're not your lawyers and try They're not my lawyers, so right. go so, ahead, don't so, go so ahead. We'll just start the Either call so Chuck or call yeah. Maxwell. Okay. Maxwell is a lawyer. Go ahead. Sorry, sorry. Call Maxwell. The cop explained the breath test and its consequences, but her stubbornness only made things more difficult. So you're very refusing? Yeah. Okay. So are you refusing to remind me of the rest of you? Okay. Alright. Overson's not your lawyer. Yeah, she wasn't. Okay. So, are you gonna provide me the breast sample? You already said you would. I'm 
The woman was charged with resisting and DUI. Witness the cop's daughter playing the role of the untouchable specter, her blade appearing fleetingly in the murky depths of favoritism. No! Red! Get your dad! No! You're not doing nothing! On October 30th, 2021, officers responded to a disturbance involving two women and one of their boyfriends. As the cops arrived and began questioning the woman in an attempt to unravel the situation, their efforts only served to further entangle the confusion. Babe, you f***ing came talking sh like a man. I can you guys, no. look, can somebody just go on the other side or Yo, something? Babe. She came to my house to f*** about her man. Okay, we'll, babe, we'll talk to you in a second. We'll talk to you in a second, alright? Relax. Babe. I don't know. Do 11-5. Leave me a message. Baby, come here. No. No, she needs to go. She wants to deal with her man. All right. Talking yeah, I, I got Rick, right here. All right. Step over here for me. Did you call us? You guys aren't related? No. no. Okay. Look at what she did to me. What, she bites you? She, she bite me and she took a butcher knife out on me. Where? Who, she who bit else the saw shit it? out of my boyfriend, too. Okay. How, what all started this tonight? I was telling her that I was having problems with him, and then when he came to see me, she just lashed out at him because she was. Okay. So she over she reacted because she thought you guys were having problems whenever he yes. showed up. Yes. What happened whenever he showed up? She started going off on him. Well, like and what? I, That's what I'm trying to figure out. What, what did she say? What telling she do? him that he's you know he's treating me like that I don't deserve it. But she kept saying things and then she hit him. And when she hit him in the face, that's when I got up and I grabbed her. I'm like Joe, you know, I'm like calm down. It's yeah. okay. It's okay. okay. And she just and started she spazzing. Her, yeah, she, she just spazzed. What happened with the knife? She took out the butcher knife and that they, was... they grabbed her, her. My boyfriend and the kids grabbed her. What did she do with the knife? She tried to attack me with it. She came after you with yes. it? Yes. That was after she bit you? Yes. Okay. Yes. Did everybody see it here? Yes. Okay. Do me a favor. Just hang out right here for me. Yeah, okay. Yeah. Would you mind filling out a statement for me? Okay. My girlfriend came here to hang out with her. You know, to hang out with her, to talk to, you know, talk about me, whatever. So I'm trying to speak to my girl and I get here and I feel this. I literally been here like 15 minutes. Just hang out with 
hang out right there for a minute. Alright. This is your hair! I'm sick of this jo Jojo, is that what you want to be called? Is that right? Jojo, that's what you go by? Is that what you want to be called? Alright, Jojo, Jojo. Hey, hey. Bring it. Listen, listen, listen. You yelling makes this take longer before we can figure it out. Alright? You know what? Listen, if you bring it down, we can figure everything out. But when you're yelling, we can't. I got nothing to do with Okay. This is. Yo, she called me this listen, weekend. Listen, Jojo, no, I, I listened to her no. song. Jojo. She called me this weekend and goes, Bring it down. I got nothing to do with him. I want a weekend getaway. Okay, fine. You want a weekend getaway. You come to my house. Listen to me. You come to my house, you got a weekend getaway. Okay, fine. That's it. But she's like, I, got, I want nothing to do with him, blah, blah, this and that. So what you want me to do? I got, I got nothing to do with this shit, man. I got nothing to do with it. I'm sick of this shit. I got my own life and my kids. Yeah, sick of it? You see? I got nothing to do with this shit. I, I'm, I'm tired of this shit. This is the shit between her and her and, and you know what? They get us involved in it. And I'm done. I'm done. I'm done. I got nothing to do with this shit. Mina, get out. Hello. Oh, I got nothing to do with this is my house and I told her when I moved here I don't want no drama and she keeps bringing drama between her and her man and I'm tired of this I'm tired of this I don't want none of this no more I don't I'm tired of this come on really I got my own life with my kids my sons and I gotta do with her and her man. Come on, man. I don't need this. Thank you, babe. This is my drunk friend. This is what I'm trying to tell him. And they don't want to listen to it. When the woman's actions pushed the situation out of control, the police implemented direct legal measures to bring it back to order. This is not my drama. This is her drama with her man. I'm done. We'll get it figured out. No, this is my baby. Rick. Danny, come here. This is not my drama. This is her drama with her man. I got nothing to do with this Okay. And this is what I told her. She called me today and goes, oh, I got drama with him and him. Okay, that's not my drama. I have nothing to do with this I got my kids, my life. I got nothing to do with this man. I'm done. She needs to This is her life, her man, not mine. I'm done with this I'm done with this she gotta go. You f people look. You's letting her go. Meanwhile, listen, nobody's it's my going. House. Listen, nobody's going and anywhere yet. All right. She's right Relax. there. Her f no. Yeah, she's not you going nowhere. She's the one that says she don't want nothing to do with her man, but okay. she's saying drama in my house. No, it's not right. It's not right. It's my house. How can you say that, Danny? Really? He hasn't said anything. It's our house, and she's talking. But she doesn't want Rufino here. Really? She doesn't want to fit on here, but she's so okay. She called me today and told me that he's, she's tired of his She's tired of his But she keeps running to me for, because she's scared. But nobody's doing shit about it. And it's always me in the middle of it. No, and you are not doing nothing about it. These guys are not, not doing nothing about it, but it's always me in the middle. So how is that fair? How's it fair? This is my house! And it's not fair? Are you kidding me? You can bring me in? It's not, I'm not fair! Jojo, bring it down, listen. Jojo, relax. Hey, Jojo, relax. Are you kidding me? We're talking to everybody. Relax. Relax? It's my house and I can't relax. All right, well you need to so we can figure out what happened. Really? If you're yelling, we can I am relaxed, and her man's the okay. one that's been beating on her, and I'm the one that's been f***ing protecting her for months. And that's what pisses me off. And nobody's about it. Nobody's doing nothing We're working about on it now, but no one can hear anything because she's really? just screaming over really? everything. Really? Right? You know what? Just bring it down. You know what? My father was a f***ing cop, and... You know what? My father was a cop for years. Go ahead, do it. We're because not. You, I don't care. I'm done with this. 
That's the way she You know what? She's trying to talk some sense like this. She right. has gone through so much shit and nobody's done anything about it. F you! Get out of my face. Sir. Come on. Whatever. Come on. Yeah, Come on. Yeah, Come on now. Stand up, man. Now. My husband's talking to me. I'm telling you stand up. No. We're not, we're not trying what? to make this harder than it is. Okay. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. No. Listen. Listen to what they're saying. Now why? Because she f deal with all this That's true. That's but nobody's problem. helping me. But I'm helping you. No, you're Stop not. It. We can't hear you because out when you're doing nothing but yelling. Helping. So Come on. When really? You it down, really? You're helping me? Right. Really? Are you helping me? Are you helping me? Right. No. Get up. Shut hey. the f Get up. Are you helping me? No. Get up. Get up. No. Get up. Get up. Get up. Don't make this worse. Nope. I'm just going uh, to the car. Listen, all right? we're, we're not going to no. get up. Judge it. Walk your feet. Come on. Don't make us carry you. Come on. Are you helping me? No, you're not. My son's right there. No, you're not. You're making yourself. No. Nope. Rick! Rick! No. You're not helping me, you Get off of me. Because I'm not just the one doing nothing wrong. You want to really. Get, you're not helping me. All right. Get off. Which car are we going to? The second one? You know. Rick! JoJo, stand up. Rick, are you father? No. Rick, get your dad. No, you're not doing nothing. You're not helping me. Are you kidding me? Relax. No. Rick, get your father. Get Jersey and get my father. My father's a cop. Okay. No. Get get the off of me, you son of. You're not my father. You, you son of. Got Relax. Yeah. Rick, I got it. I get got dad. It. No, he's pressing his. F Hello. No. Rick. Rick. No. Rick. Oh, he's getting from the other side. Stay in the car. Hey. Hey. F you. Keep your teeth to yourself. Yeah, okay. The cops obtained a statement from the witness that left them stunned, and they then moved forward with their next course of action. Be careful, she tries to bite me. So. What are you doing? Oh, wow, big whoop. Rick! What is she doing? Because he, he, he keeps trying to say that I'm the car. To him. Get in the I'm car. I'm not doing nothing. I don't care. Excuse me, I'm not doing shit. Oh, my God. What? Wow. He's feeding. Go ahead. <laughs> I'm not doing nothing. Move your foot. I'm not doing sh. Change the address to 132 Florida Avenue. Thing. Like she's out of control. Yeah, no, no. He just look, look. It's not only me that she she bit. Look, look, no, he has that thing right. too. Come on. Yeah, well, that's what I'm saying. That's like, what we're asking we, you we for. Really, I mean, she at least needs to get in a, a program. Oh, I'm at peace. I just get a bit. No, <laughs> I just, you know, listen. I talked to her as a friend. Listen, yeah, I'm yeah, having problems me. with him, but yeah. it wasn't for her to react like that. Yeah. You know, when he got here, he came to see me. I asked him, listen, I'm, I'm yeah. close by. Come see me so we can talk. And she lashed out yeah. she she started with him first and when she did that i calmly i calmly got up and told her to stop i said it's okay it's okay i'll be fine you know i, know, I just what i'm trying to tell you is that is unacceptable like for us not to press charges is a little bit of slap in the face because we're out here like she needs to, you guys can do whatever you want through the state you can you can end up dropping it you could say we just she needs some help it's but, kind of funny for us to do that because we're friends yeah no, yeah <laughs> yeah but i mean she's using a knife and she's yeah, freaking cutting yeah. people no, so I you mean, saw that you know she did come in with a butcher it's inexcusable what she did so she did. i don't care so at this point we were essentially what about you know, if we you can't, we can't make you do anything but we need your help in this yeah she, she needs to get some anger management at the least man i mean this is like crazy you can't be you know, grabbing knives and hitting people and stuff. Like, she's an adult. Yeah. She's going to be biting you and threatening you with knives. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I, I, I'm not, you're not, we're not worried about I'm sorry. <laughs> but you, any of you, because like I said, I mean, she, she's going to jail tonight. There's no doubt about Timothy it. Has to, no, he's telling him to help. And he just stood inside because he knew. Sir, if you would stand up there by the house. Nope. Just, just leave him alone. Hey, hey, leave him alone. I'm not making this something bigger than it is. 
Are, are, are you guys willing to? Yes, yes, okay, yes. Okay, thank you. Because like I said, if one of you do, one of you don't, that's fine. But at least somebody needs because we, there's too much going on here for us to ignore. We're, we're not trying to send her to prison. She, she needs to get a wake-up call. She needs some kind of anger management or something to the state. You can't get drunk and attack friends, do you? No, I'm not good. This was unnecessary. Yes, I am having problems with you, and I can tell her, you know, but it wasn't for her to get like this. You know, I didn't come, I didn't come here for this. I could have stood the f room. Temple, I'm sorry. Oh, my bad. Do you have ID on you, ma'am? I don't even know where the f Would you, can you, can you, can you grab it? Your, yours and hers, please. I, I, I can't even think straight right now. Okay. I can't, I can't. I, I can't even believe this is going on. I can't All right. They just got to talk to you for a second. Good. Yeah. 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 So she's working on her statement. He doesn't want to do anything. Yeah. We'll still list him in the case report. Just yeah. list him as a victim. Yeah. Because it still shows, like, you know, that he had, she attacked him. Uh, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to get him to do the... Uh, Thing where he says he doesn't want to. The vi um, as long as he's set on X, I'm not. Yeah, it's on. Um, I don't have time for it. Like, if you don't want to put this, I mean, he said it. So. Yeah, he said it a couple times. Yeah. I even verified it just him. I'd said, like to find that knife. Hey, Michael. What, is she going to do anything now? I mean, she's out of him? Yeah, yeah, they can I'm not, I don't want any of us to get Call? Fair call. Oh, here's all this. Alright. Cool, thank you. He doesn't want to do anything. Yeah, yeah. The woman was charged with disorderly conduct and resisting. For more stories about criminals, subscribe to the channel.